Hello and welcome back to FSC TV. I'm Sophia Gonzalez. And I'm Andrew Pauling. Let's get right to the news. Studio Box is holding a themed version of their comedy show later tonight from 11 p.m. to midnight. The central theme is Lumberjacks, and the show will be held in the Jenkins Fieldhouse. This edition of Studio Box is also in conjunction with the January Scholars Weekend, which typically brings out the best content from the crew. A packed house is expected, so arrive early as seating is first come, first serve. The women's basketball team extended their win streak to 14 games after defeating the St. Leo University Lions on Wednesday with a final score of 68 to 34. Anya Fuchrobotin and Camille Giardina led the Mox with 21 and 20 points respectively. The Moccasins defense held the Lions to just a 24.5 shooting percentage and the visitors 34 points given up, 30 points were the fewest given up by FSC since 2012. Newly minted Governor Ron DeSantis visited a SunTrax complex in Polk County this week where testing is done on toll road equipment, smartphone payments, and lane markings. DeSantis later went to a gathering where county and municipal leaders expressed frustrations about Polk County traffic. The Florida governor stated that he was going to work with Florida senators to clear the gridlocks and to push for more federal funding. Yesterday, the U.S. Senate rejected a House bill to reopen the federal government. Airline workers are worried about safety while the Transportation Security Administration works without pay, causing an increase in absences at work and longer lines at the airport. Also next week will mark the second week 800,000 federal workers will not receive a paycheck and 15 cabinet level departments have not been funded. Today's weather is a high of 61 with a low of 43. It is expected to be sunny throughout the day with the possibility of rain over the weekend. And that's your news for Friday, January 25th. I'm Andrew Pauling. And I'm Sophia Gonzalez. We'll see you back next week.